Hi everybody, just a quick video um, to let you know that I haven't been able to post um, very much recently. It seems that I'm far too busy during the summer months to put out videos, certainly to the quality that I want. I know I've put out some rubbish before um, and I really want to improve um, both on the quality of the videos, the con you know, the, the ideas behind the videos, but also um, myself, you know, I, I sort of started this channel to grow myself, you know, and push myself way out of my comfort zone um, to improve as a person. So I haven't really got the time to do that. I don't want to put out really quick videos that'll be um, pretty poor um, to watch. So a bit like, a bit like this random monologue, um, my, my, what I really want to do is rethink the videos through and put out some, some good stuff. Uh, I also wanted to quickly update on um, what I used to film the video. So until now, I've used an iPhone 8, which is a, a bit of an antique, if I'm honest. Um, but now I've taken the delivery of an iPhone 13 Pro Max. Yes, I know someone's doing pretty well. Uh, no, it's, a, it's a work phone. It's not mine, unfortunately, but um, I am able to use it and hopefully you'll be able to see that the footage is better. So I'm going to put in some footage now that I filmed on my iPhone 8 um, and then following that some footage on the iPhone 13 Pro Max. Hopefully the new footage is much clearer, certainly looks it on the phone and whilst I'm here I may as well just quickly show you the garden, how it's looking at this time of year, early August, uh, because as I say you know uh, I probably won't be putting out any more videos um, until well into autumn, uh, but then I, I do plan to post regularly then uh, through the remainder of autumn into winter and early spring as well and then I'll, I'll end up getting too busy again I'm sure but um, the banana's doing really well this year you might not think that but um, actually I do struggle with, with this banana I think it's Musa Baju but actually it's not very hardy at all uh, always dies down to the to the base uh, I'm not sure it just doesn't seem to, to grow very well for me normally but yeah it's looking all right now um, the big Trachycarpus fortunii, tried flowering again, um, it's its second attempt but again it's sort of just aborted, uh, I think you can see, oh yes down here this is from last year, that was its flower space from last year and then probably about a foot, maybe even a foot and a bit, uh, up is uh, the new ones, but um, well, from, from the spring anyway, but they came to nothing. Um, so maybe next year um, it'll, it'll flower. It looks really nice when it's, it, or it will look really nice when it flowers, I think. Quickly um, have a look at the apple tree. I know it's not at all exotic, um, but, and it sort of takes pride of place uh, at the bottom of the garden. It's, you know, you can see it from the house. You can see it from pretty much wherever you are in the garden. It's a shame that it's in this location really, but obviously I can't move it. It was here when I moved in. Uh, the kids love climbing it and 
it's very fruitful it it um we've been eating apples for about two or three weeks from it now um we probably eat five apples a day from it um so it does actually save us quite a bit of money as well for a couple of months uh, but what is evident is that there are far too many apples even eating five a day uh, we're not going to get through all these so what i'm going to do in the winter is take off some of you know maybe that bit um take off this bit and just make it much narrower so that i can uh, maybe plant some other things either side of it uh, a bit more exotic looking so anyway, that's enough of that. Let's get back to um, a few more shots of the border. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in a few months. Enjoy the rest of your summer.